Hey, I'm Sarah Carnes, and we know your health matters. That is why we're talking with Dr. Varian today at Summa Health. Thank you for joining us. Thanks, Sarah. Good to be here. So first of all, I want to ask you, what are common signs and symptoms of heart failure? So heart failure is a clinical syndrome in which the heart weakens, which can result in symptoms like fatigue, shortness of breath, generalized weakness, and sometimes swelling in the legs. Those are the usual things that people experience. Now, can you describe the treatment options available for heart failure patients and what are the benefit to the patients? So I'll tell you, Sarah, in 2022, the therapies that we have for congestive heart failure have never been better. There have been huge advances in the past several years. Most of the treatments we use are medications, but we also use exercise, dietary changes. There are medical devices, advanced medical devices that we can use in certain situations. Uh, so there are many, many options for patients with heart failure. They're very individualized. So some patients do well with certain treatments and others do well with other ones. Um, but we have many, many options and uh, uh, it's a very exciting time to be treating patients with heart failure. Now, I understand that SUMA it has now the ability to implant the left ventricle assist devices. I hope I said that correct, but it's for patients suffering from heart failure. Can you tell us more about that? Sure, so a left ventricular assist device is an implanted device which uh, almost takes over the function of the left heart when it's failed to the point where the patient is no longer able to continue living a normal life without something else. We use it um, when a patient is not eligible at that time for heart transplant. Well, that's wonderful. Thank you again for the time today. If you would like to know more, you can go to their website. It's sumahealth.org slash heart to learn more. Thank you again, doctor.